Hey, what's going on everybody? Hey, welcome back to the Trade More YouTube channel. In this video, I'm going to show you a TTM squeeze hack I bet you didn't know existed. So if you want to learn how to trade options using the TTM squeeze and you have one hour a day to do it, then this video is going to be perfect for you. But before we get into it, do me a favor, guys. Hey, smash that subscribe button, all right? Because I literally go live on this channel every single day talking about the markets. All right, everybody. So let's go ahead and start off just really briefly talking about the TTM squeeze. The TTM squeeze is an indicator that was created by Simpler Trading. Now, I don't uh, represent Simpler Trading, but I am affiliated in a sense that if you get the indicator through my link, then, hey, I get credit. So this is what I do for anybody that ends up getting the indicator through my link, okay? If you get the indicator through my link, I have over $2,000 worth of free bonuses that go with this indicator. They're custom codes and columns. And so if you get that indicator through my link, then I'm gonna give you those for free, okay? It's a win-win situation. Check down below in the description. Okay, so whenever you hear the term the squeeze, what that means is it's a contraction of volatility. Okay, things are getting quiet. I want you to think of the squeeze as you are, you just got done running the 100 yard dash and now you need to take a break. You're taking a break before your next big or your next run. So what happens is with stocks, they, they trend, right? They expand in volatility and then they take a break. They trend, they take a break. Okay. And so a lot of the way that you see people talking about the squeeze on the internet is let's assume, for example, you had an uptrend moving average, okay? Maybe the 8, 21, and this is the stock. So the stock is doing this, and then all of a sudden, the stock is consolidating. You're going to see in a minute on the chart, you're going to see the squeeze indicator in action, okay? It shows you that contraction of volatility. And a lot of things out there, a lot of people tell you to accumulate inside while it's in a squeeze ahead of the next explosion, right? So you get in early before, boom, the squeeze, they call it fires. Well, I'm going to show you a hack today that is completely different than any way that you probably looked at the squeeze before, okay? So let's go ahead and let's get into this hack. All right, so the squeeze. Now, uh, a lot of you, this is probably how you currently trade it. You know, you have your moving averages, maybe the eight exponential to 21 exponential. And then this is represents price. So price is going up, for example, this is an uptrend. And then all of a sudden it consolidates, right? it starts to form a pattern. And then down here at the bottom, which you'll see in a little bit, the squeeze indicator will illustrate that through dots, right? Whether it's the squeeze, the squeeze pro, which I love the squeeze pro, by the way. Then um, they'll tell you to, and I say they, pretty much everybody on the internet will tell you to start building your position inside the squeeze, right? Volatility is contraction. Get into the, uh, you know, get into the trade while it's quiet. And you're anticipating that the squeeze is going to fire, right? Volatility is going to expand. And I have tons of videos on the squeeze. Just check for my playlist, TTM Squeeze. You're, I mean, you'll love it. But that's how they teach it, right? And they say that, well, whatever the direction the moving average is, 60, 70% of the time, it'll fire in that direction, okay? Well, today, I'm going to show you a hack that nobody else on YouTube land, at least that I know of, is talking about to make this squeeze way more effective and also avoid what everybody in the squeeze world knows as the fake out. All right, so let's go ahead and start looking at my chart right now. Okay, so this is XLF. Okay, this is XLF, which is the financial sector. Not a big deal, but really quickly, this down here is the Squeeze Pro. And again, I'm not going to do a, a lesson right now on the Squeeze Pro. I got an entire playlist, but I'll give you this. When you see either a black dot, a red dot, or an orange dot, we're in a squeeze, right? It represents consolidation. So the squeeze, consolidation, right? Consolidation. Okay, so I'm going to show you right now a simple hack that works massively. So I'm going to go to my drawing items, and this is a TDM air trade. And all I'm going to do is, 
I am going to draw a box and let me just change that color. All right, so I think this would be a great time in the video just to ask you, hey, if you're finding any value in this video, if you're learning anything, okay, do me a favor, smash that like button, all right? That thumbs up button. I really appreciate it. It lets YouTube know that, hey, this video is helping people out and it can spread it out to, to more individuals just like yourself. Hey, I really appreciate it. Thank you very much. Let's get back to the video. So you can really see it. And for this illustration, I'll just make it orange, right? So you can see it. So there's a squeeze, there's a squeeze, there's the squeeze. And again, we'll just do that. But for example, right, you got this. These are the moving averages. They're going up, consolidates, boom, goes up, consolidates, boom, goes up. So you see the squeeze and then the squeeze fires, right? The squeeze, the squeeze fires. So you go up, trending, consolidation, boom, right? Now, the problem with that is, and a lot of y'all know, is you've got this time right here where you might have got faked out. Because a lot of people on the internet are talking about, hey, if it breaks, let's say, for example, the 21 exponential, the 34, get out. Well, <laughs> so if you get in a squeeze and you set your stop loss here and it goes down and stops you out, lots of times it'll go in the direction that you originally Thought it was going to go, but you're not in it. Okay, so this is what you're going to do for this hack. So after you draw these boxes around this consolidation of squeeze, I want you to draw a line pretty much in the middle, okay? Draw a line pretty much in the middle and draw a line pretty much in the middle, give or take, okay? So remember, see the squeeze, draw the box, draw the line. Now, this right here represents institutional footprints. This is what the big money is doing, okay? And now this line, I don't, but well, you can still get in when the squeeze, you know, inside the squeeze. But when it comes back to this line, and I'm going to show you in a minute, either this line or below, this is the time that you can either add or actually get in the squeeze then. Look at the squeeze pro histogram. Look at the ready aim fire pro, which I'm also affiliated with simpler and I also offer bonuses for that. And so it's in the squeeze. You can accumulate ahead of the breakout. Boom, if it breaks out, you hit your target. If not, it comes back to your line and you see that rotation you can add or enter, right? So here, now this one didn't come back, but you're still in it. But look at this. This is where I really want to talk about. So this is where people get faked out. You see how the squeeze fire to the downside? So you're in the squeeze. You draw your line. I don't want you to enter when it's above the line. You enter when it's at the line or below, okay? So in this case, you don't enter in a squeeze. It fires to the downside. Perfect. Because what you're going to do is you're going to use this line as your stop loss. So you're going to enter on that shift of momentum in between that zone. Or when you get the squeeze, you're looking to enter not in the squeeze, either when it comes back to that line or under it when you get a shift in momentum. Let's see really quickly if I can find a, another illustration for you. All right, so look at this. This is a XLP. Again, it doesn't really matter, but look, we're going to find a squeeze. We're going to draw the box. We're going to find a squeeze. We're going to draw the box. Okay, we're going to find a squeeze, and we're going to draw the box. And then what are we going to do? We're going to draw a line in the middle, in the middle, in the middle. Now, let's go ahead and analyze that bad boy. All right, so you got the squeeze. You're not going to, well, you can get in when it's in the squeeze, but now if it goes against you, then you don't have to be so quick to jump out. Look at this. It fires to the downside. Everybody's getting stopped out. Momentum shifts. You get in, boom, and you know you can get out of the 127 extension or what you got. Here, you know, you wouldn't have got in it because it went right back into a squeeze. But look at this. In a squeeze, 
fired to the downside. Everybody got stopped out. Not you. You got in down here. Now, in this particular case, you know, you've got this line. It's under them. If I went back, and again, I just kind of did this on the fly, but if I went back and I basically identified another squeeze, so check this out. Okay, you got, this is that squeeze right there pretty much. You know, we can go back here and this squeeze and draw that line. Okay. Again, I got lots of videos on this. Uh, let's see here. Do, 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 draw that line. There you go. That, I call that the buy zone, right? You've heard any of the buy zone. So now you've got the buy zone. It's in the buy zone underneath the box, shifting momentum. Boom, you got it. So this, <laughs> this TTM squeeze hack will instantly, number one, improve your TTM squeeze trading. And number two, it's going to really help you avoid getting faked out. Draw the box, draw the line, get in under the line, and then use the other line as a point of reference. All right, everybody. Hey, I hope you enjoyed uh, today's video on this TTM squeeze hack. If you implement that hack, you are going to get results fast in your trading. Hey, guys, um, if you found value again in this video, do me a favor. Smash that like button, all right? So YouTube can spread this out to more people. And if you enjoy content like this, think about subscribing to the channel. I literally go live every single day on this channel talking about the markets. Hey, and don't forget to join us Tuesdays and Thursdays right here on this channel at 10.30 a.m. Central Standard Time for our options live show. Hey, and if you're interested in any of the indicators that we use, like this TTM Squeeze Pro, if you're interested in um, enhancing your option trading, just check down below in the description, right? It's got everything that we offer. And you guys know if you end up getting that TTM Squeeze indicator through my affiliate link down below, I'm going to hook you up with all sorts of bonuses, all right? We'll see you Tuesday and Thursday, guys for the Options Live show.